Hi, I'm Dr. Kim Logan Nolan and welcome to Live To Be Well. Want to talk about sometimes you have to just stand down and be still and even sometimes have to say no, even when you don't want to, because God has to guide us. Why is it so important that God guides our decisions? So that the right decisions will be made. The Bible says, seek ye first the kingdom of God and all his righteousness shall be added unto thee, Matthew 6, 33. Then as I look at Proverbs chapter three, five and six, trust in the Lord with all thine heart and lean not to thine, thine own understanding. In all thy ways acknowledge him and he shall direct thy path. Why wouldn't I want the God of this universe to make the decisions in my life? Sometimes it's hard to wait, I know. Been there, done that. But God says, wait on the Lord, Micah 7, 7. And when we wait on God, let me tell you what we need to be doing. You need to release. You need to regroup. You need to reboot. You need to reactivate yourself. Find out your passion in your life. And maybe at that time while you're doing that, God is watching you and saying, okay, my daughter and my son is busy. They're not moping. They're not sitting back having a pity party. That's right, I said pity party in order for you to receive what God is getting ready to do. I don't know about you. It's about a new direction every day, every day. I live with being a breast cancer survivor every day. You know, Dr. Kim loves her pink. I love to send a message out to people, but not just in the month of October, but every day. So let's mobilize ourselves. Let's look at not pulling ourselves back into a place that's unhealthy, but allowing God to take control and to lead us into where he, he wants us to be. Be still and know that God is God. What did he tell Moses? He said, Moses, hold the rod and I'll part the Red Sea. God is ready to part your Red Sea, but his timing, his timing must be the right timing. I'm Dr. Kim Logan Nolan. Wait on God. God bless.